Well, if you're downtown, you might see driverless vehicles. The Jacksonville Transportation Authority is test, te, excuse me, testing autonomous vehicles on the Bay Street Innovation Corridor. Yeah, news for Jackson reporter Caleb Yager is joining us now live downtown. Caleb, JTA is exploring new ways to make transportation more accessible. Yeah, so we're here just across the street from Vistar Ballpark, and if you look across the street here at this uh, sidewalk, you're going to see this kind of new structure with a banner that says Jacksonville Transportation Authority coming soon, Phase 1, Bay Street Innovation Corridor, and on the bottom corner, the right corner, if you see something, say something, a couple of QR codes to scan. But JTA began testing these autonomous vehicles last week, better known as AVs. It's all part of the Ultimate Urban Circulator, also known as U2C. Uh, here are some pictures of the vehicles, which are Ford E-Transit vans. They will be tested now Monday through Friday between 10 a.m. and 4 p.m. on a three-mile loop along Bay Street from Pearl Street to Everbank Stadium. When these vehicles pass by during the testing period between now and summer... You're going to be seeing one person inside the AV, and that is the onboard attendant who is the only person allowed inside as of right now. When it comes time to allow passengers inside, like we said, about summertime, uh, JTA says these vehicles will be ADA compliant and follow vehicle standards. And as I mentioned, this is all part of phase one, which will introduce these vehicles into the JTA transportation system. Plans indicate that they will keep expanding into surrounding neighborhoods in different phases and create a better connected, more transparent transportation friendly Jacksonville. JTA also mentioned that the vehicles will be operated and maintained from its autonomous innovation center. JTA added that up to nine passengers can fit into the vehicles and will travel in the same lane as ongoing traffic. Reporting live here in downtown, Caleb Yager, Channel 4, The Local Station.